Can you give me five words to e-democracy? So, so the five words I would pick are um, engagement, participation, uh, collaboration, innovation, and um, uh, what was my last one? Partnerships. Thank you. Thank you. What does open mean? That's a really hard question to answer. I, I think depending on which context you're looking at, to me, open means that um, you have access to information and data uh, and communities around which to build innovative processes for government. An optimistic view on e-democracy and open government. If I had to say my, what I'm optimistic about is the potential change that bringing together communities, researchers, um, people uh, uh, to engage in democratic processes to create new forms of government, uh, new forms of governance, and also new ways of thinking about how we solve our community challenges. We all have challenges in areas of health, education, um, environment, and those kinds of things. And by bringing us all together, I think we can start solving some of those, uh, some of those intangible problems that we've had for years. A pessimistic view on the democracy and open government? I guess if I would be pessimistic about it, um, is that I don't think we have the, the processes in place yet for how to deal with all those issues. Um, people aren't necessarily data literate, so throwing a whole bunch of data at them isn't necessarily going to help them. Uh, so how do we think about forming communities around um, uh, collaborative partnerships to really look at solutions at the local level uh, more holistically? And until we do that, I don't think we're going to have much success. What do you think will be the topics at the CDEM 2018? Uh I think the topics at CDM18 will be, did any of this work? Uh, you know, I think you know, by the time we get to that point, which is three years out, I think we'll actually have, um, hopefully, some assessments in place that look at all these vast experiments that we've been conducting uh, and see whether or not uh, it actually made any difference. Thank you, John. Sure, thank you.